Hi there, this is Renee from Floating Lights Photography. You're watching another episode of Focus Wednesdays, and today I'm going to show you how to add a vignette to a photo. So if you don't know what a vignette is, it's kind of the dark edges around a photo that is usually applied to draw your focus into the center of an image. So it's a really cool effect. A lot of people use it. I use it a lot on my images, so I'm going to show you how to do that today. So I've already added a few actions to this photo and made it the way that I like it. So my final step is just to add the vignette. So you're going to make sure you're on the background layer. You're going to come down to this little circle, half circle, and you're going to create a new fill or adjustment layer. And we're going to select the gradient adjustment layer. And it's going to bring up the gradient fill box. And as you can see, the default is white and we're going to change that. So to do that, you're going to click on this little gradient box here and it's going to bring up the gradient editor. So we want to change the color from white to black. You don't have to select black. It can be a dark brown or whatever color you'd like, but something black-ish, dark-ish, and you're gonna select OK. So now it's going from black to white, which is perfect. That's what we'd like. So we're gonna hit OK on the gradient editor. And now for style, we're gonna change it to radial. And we're gonna make sure that this little check mark next to reverse is selected. Now for your angle, you can adjust your angle if you want. I always leave mine for vignettes at 90, um, but I do adjust the scale. So 100% is exactly what it looks like right here. So if you make it bigger, it makes the circle bigger. If you make it smaller, obviously the circle is smaller. So you have to kind of find your happy medium. Mine is somewhere between 125 and 145%. So for this one, I'm gonna use 135 and I'm gonna hit OK. Now it looks a little bit silly we don't quite want it to be like this so we're gonna change the blend mode and to do that you're gonna click this little drop down menu here right now it's selected to normal but we're gonna change it to either overlay or soft light those are kind of the two nicest ones overlay is a little bit dark it really richens and darkens the edges it's almost like a burn and it's not quite the look I'm going for in this photo so I'm actually gonna use soft light which is a lot less harsh, but still makes the edges darker. So here's the before, and here is the after, and it's still a little bit much, so you can adjust your opacity as well. So I'm going to bring it down a little bit, maybe to 70%. And then here's the before and the after. So you're gonna set it to your style and customize it to your liking, but it really will just draw your eye into the center and focus into the center of your image. I really hope you enjoyed the tutorial. If you have any questions, you can always email me at hello at floatinglightsphoto.com or you can find me on Facebook at facebook.com slash floatinglightsphotography. Thanks so much for watching and have a great day.